Hello guys, welcome back to the jQuery chat for the ASP.NET. Today we're gonna talk about the next two jQuery chat controls uh, from the Google APIs. Okay, so let's do that first. Let's see the demo first. Okay, this is the gate chart, and uh, the second one is the geo chart. Okay, uh, the geo chart you knows already because uh, for the most of Google applications, for example, Google Analytics and all that, you will see these kind of charts. Okay, and uh, for the it's a meter charge, meter chart. You can uh, set the particular, um, you can say the expense incomes. Okay, the revenue etc. In this kind of chart, okay, uh, which depends like a uh, memory usage of a particular server and all that you can show in this kind of chart. Okay, let's see the first uh, gauge chart. So here the code is so very simple as usual. Uh, the all the uh, structure of designer chart it's uh, similar to the older one. Okay, we have uh, imported the package for a particular chart. After that draw method we have an and data the data we have a label and uh, values okay for the memory CPU and networks okay we have an option to this is the width height okay we have a uh, lots of other uh, properties out there this is the red from and red to okay let's talk about the first section that is red from and red to that means you have to specify the total uh, range for the red color then after the yellow color and then after you can uh, set the minor tricks that is the if you see this kind of slashes just like a watch then you have to set it the number if I set to down red it will come from the outside let's check just notice that okay it becomes the uh, you can say the strength becomes the down okay it's so totally dependent on your requirements after that we have uh, drawn a chart and we have assigned all the different different options to the chart control okay here is something different we haven't seen in any other chart okay uh, for the real environment we have to update the data okay according to the data the chart should be design so every five seconds we're gonna update the all three charts okay so that's why we have a data object then it's have a set value we are assigning the zero for the first series and uh, we are going to change the total number of value it's coming from the random values okay all we have to set that is this this is the zero chart first chart second chart and this is the uh, the series and the other one is value and after that we are uh, redrawing the chart okay now let's update this on every five seconds the data is going to update and as usual the data is updated the chart is also getting updated one two three four five and the chart is updated 99, 78, and 73. After 5 seconds, it will get updated automatically. 99, 74, 46. Okay, 85, 51, 69. As usual, you can uh, set the time intervals and get the chart updated as the data is changed in your DB or in any other sections. Okay. Now coming to the geo chart. It's a very simple chart. Okay. It's a uh, predefined by the Google APIs you have to just pass a data it will automatically detect where the country is and how much color we want to set for that okay so here is the code for that geo chart as usual uh, load the package uh, from the Google APIs and set the countries and uh, the popularity or like the value for that okay if you want to uh, set the usage of your websites, the customers uh, getting using your website in which countries, okay? So if you have uh, that kind of data, you can show that data to the admin like by using this chart, 
okay uh, suppose I'm gonna add one more country that is India and we have a lot of data 60,000 okay we do not have any other options just use the geo chart assign render it into the div and uh, draw a chart just refresh this and here the India is now zero it will get updated with the dark values and the legend will be will also updated because we have a maximum value that is 60,000 okay it is getting, getting down let me change it 60,000 to 6,000 okay so the other will get proper values okay if I set it to Canada it's a 500 700 and I'm gonna set it to the 800 okay now I'm getting it properly Russia is 700 and the popularity of India it's around 800 right I hope you guys have enjoyed this video tutorial thanks for watching Bye-bye.